Hi, I'm Ryan Callahan. I'm an automation specialist here at the Oregon Shakespeare Festival, and this is the Off the Rails desk. Um, it's actually six axes of automation. There's four lift casters, and then two motors that run the desktop up and down. It starts the show in a writing desk state, and then it actually travels up seven inches to become a bar. It goes back and forth and rolls all around, and it pretty much stays on stage the entire time. Its frame is actually steel, and it's battery operated. Um, so we've built the frame here in automation, did the wiring, installed the motors, passed it off the props, who gave it its rustic period uh, wood cladding, and then it went to paints for its period paint treatment, and then back to us for some final tuning. This actually uses three RC car controllers, all wired to a couple Arduinos that send serial commands to those RC controllers. Um, so we control those six motors all with these little uh, RC car controllers. Um, which is pretty neat. Uh, so that was an interesting new challenge for me, having to do some serial commands through Arduino, talking to three different platforms. Um, a lot of the fun, innovative parts of this project were 3D printing a lot of its components, um, a lot of its limit triggers, um, lock collars, and some of its electrical components were all 3D printed here in our shop and then installed in this machine. Our mechanical designer, James Dean, did all of the mechanical design for this, uh, as well as some of the electrical uh, design. I did the electrical fabrication, and our automation programmer, Jennifer Hansen, uh, did a lot of the programming. And Gizmo, Tim Hannon, also did a lot of the uh, automation fabrication of its moving parts and pieces. Yeah, it's actually pretty, pretty common that the whole team gets to come together on these projects. Um, it's, uh, we're a pretty good team. We all parse it out pretty evenly and uh, come together to make something pretty cool happen. Uh, very excited to get this beast in off the rails and get it working, and uh, very excited for the show to open. But uh, we were very happy to make such a heavy piece of scenery with multi-use a lot easier and less noticeable for actors to move around the stage. Uh, hopefully it doesn't steal a spotlight. I think it's subtle enough. <laughs> it should, be, uh, should slip under the radar.